no matter what helicopter you're flying, the key is a good setup. And out of all these different aircraft, I don't do a whole lot different in one than what I do the other. In general, I start my approaches about 60, 65, and then right from the time I start my approach, I'm slowly decreasing the speed all the way in. Key is a good setup. Right now we're on downwind. I have a nice uh, downwind base and final kind of setup where I know everything's at. I'm gonna go ahead, full carb heat. I do 500 feet for downwind, 70 knots, we got that. We've got our airspeed altitude and trim. Everything's nice where we like it. So we're gonna go shoot for the numbers 28. As soon as I'm at beam 28, I'm gonna start slowing the aircraft down and start a small, very small rate of descent. Now we always do the three things the same at the beginning of a descent. A little bit of down collective, a little bit of right pedal, and a little bit of aft cyclic. And then I have a row of trees over to the left. If I come over those trees at 300 AGL, I know that I am going to be on a normal approach. It takes all the guesswork out, work out of trying to decide, is this a normal, is this shallow, is this deep? Right now I'm descending down to 1100. Textbook is 300 AGL for a textbook approach, the start of your approach. So I want to be at 60, 1100, in trim. When I start the approach, zero rate of descent, so it's a nice setup. So I got my 60, I'm about 1200, coming around for my tree line. And if I do it right, I'm gonna be at 1100, 60, in trim, re re zero rate of descent when I come over those trees. All right, I'm a little slow, so I'm gonna pull up a little bit of power. Get rid of that descent, there's 1,100 feet, get back up to my 60. Now I'm using the compass down to the numbers 28. So there's my numbers, I'm 300 AGL, there's my normal approach. So I'm gonna go a little down collective, a little right pedal, a little bit of aft cyclic. So I started at 60, then I'm gonna go to 55, and then I'm gonna go to 40, or I mean 45, and then 40. It's a gradual process the whole time we're coming in. So I'm not really looking at any of the gauges or the instruments. I'm just focusing on my numbers 2.8. I'm using the collective to control my angle. I'm using the cyclic to control my speed. About 50 feet AGL, I'm gonna put a little left pedal in to get in line with the runway. Prior to 50 feet, we keep it trim with the wind. With numbers 2.8 still on my uh, line of sight from the beginning of the approach. Keeping the aircraft level. Raising a little collective, adjusting, or adding left pedal because we've added a little power. And right down to the numbers, 2.8. Just in, another shipment of our Amazon number one bestsellers, top 10 checkride tips, and helicopter checkride. We bought the books for you. You just pay shipping and handling here in the U.S. And Heather ships them to you here from the Hogs Hangar. There's a link down below to get either book. So head down below to get your free paperback. We'll see you in the next video. Peace out.